What is this, honey? <laughs> no. Love no. <laughs> no, it's a hate note. No. <laughs> Dear Darla. <laughs> Bro, he was so childish. You right? make me vomit. No, damn well he loves us. <laughs> Love Alf Alpha. 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 He he was down bad the whole movie. That boy was sick on some Darla. He said, I'm not ashamed of you. I just don't want anybody to see you. <laughs> that does it, mister. I'm out of here. Period. <laughs> That's right, Darla. Stand up for yourself. You won't. You don't let nobody put you in no closet. Darla was not on it. Okay, she was like, "I'm a baby. I'm not sitting up in this dusty club with your friends." <laughs> <laughs> you need to take me out. What happened to the boat? We was just in the boat. <laughs> oh my god! Did he take you on that on the yacht for the first date, and you find out he lived with it? Six of his friends. You like no wonder you could afford it. You got seven roommates, bro. He paid nothing in rent. <laughs> rent thirty five dollars. Eight thousand of y'all in here. Oh, <laughs> y'all ever watch the pen dance? Strike. Yes, the bowling. The bowling. Oh my I took goodness. Sarah oh, oh, I have day. seen that. Well, Arnaz. Yes, yes. Shut up, bro. <laughs> she seen you. it. I took Sam Bowling the other day and I said, Oh, I really want to watch that. I really want to watch it. Mm-hmm. I watched it and I was like, Man, I could have filled this on my iPhone. Like, <laughs> it was a good movie. Low budget, bro. Yeah. 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 It was like kids like movies. Movies. Yeah. Um, I don't, I don't even remember what the plot was or anything. Not only that's why I remember, plot, like, I remember the movie a little bit. Mm-hmm. It was funny. <laughs> And we catch strike. And that's a Disney Channel original? Yes, mm-hmm. it is. It's a Let me check it out. It's a decon. Let me check that out. <laughs> that's how I feel when I watch, um, like, the first Cheetah Girls. I'm like, yo, Ooh. this was... Yeah. They spent just enough for it to look good. Mm-hmm. That was it. They spent enough money on the talent, and they was like, listen. It looked like a vlog. Indeed. <laughs> one World? Oh. I didn't even watch One World. Mm-hmm. They spent a lot of money on One World. Dead little. Mm. Oh, it <laughs> no, I watched it later in life because uh, there was somebody, he was trying to talk to me, he was from India. Mm. And so I said, oh, <laughs> the most I know is it's from Cheetah Girls One World. <laughs> and I watched it <laughs> for inspiration. And I said, oh. It was not a good representation of India. <laughs> oh, you know what? I was thinking about Barcelona, my man. Barcelona. Oh, that oh, one's well. good. I like that one. You gotta strut like you need Bro, they really made Raven out to be the best one. It's not enough just to oh, drink and come that? on, come mm. on, get up. That? It's your chance to shine. You said what? Why did they do that? What? Anyway. what? What? Trying to make her the bitch. Right. I was like, she really was trying to pitch y'all on and y'all didn't want to get y'all act together. She just I really said, didn't like her in that movie because I of that, didn't. but I like her now. But looking at it now, I'm like, she was trying to put some work ethic to the team so y'all, y'all could knew make this it was somewhere. a work trip. Like, <laughs> she's like, I guess we just want to have fun. I'm like, girl, we here to make it. What you talking? I mean, we can have fun, but we need to get these five, six, seven, eight. Bro, y'all literally got here for a job. Do the job. Rehearse <laughs> so y'all don't look a mess. Y'all up here trying to walk around and, and see the world. Like, that's cool and all, but do y'all know do y'all know the steps? Do y'all know the choreo? Bro, they was pissing me off. Mm-hmm. I'm going to watch it again. They tried day. to make, they tried to make, uh, what's her name, Galleria, like she was just a tyrant. I'm like. Well, and I was mad at her too. I'm, I'm mad mm-hmm. her name was Galleria. Me too. What a, what a name. Because her mama liked shopping. <laughs> Is that the, I'm pretty I sure. I think it was, like, it was something like that because her mama mm-hmm. was a fashion designer. Because mm-hmm, her mama liked to shop. Yes, yes, yes. That's that Choo-chi. song. What's her name? That's my girl. Choo-chi. No, I'm talking the about mama? the mama. Oh, That's the mama. Uh, Lynn Whitfield. Lynn Whitfield. Shout out to Lynn Whitfield. Ooh. Black legend. She um. Don't she usually play a mean mama though? Yeah, she she always play like a hoity toity like mm-hmm. uh rich Bougie. rich bitch, yeah. if you will. Mm-hmm. I enjoyed her though. In and and Greenleaf, Greenleaf, when I tell you she did Ooh. everything. I, y'all still watch Greenleaf? I mean, it's over now. It was good. But it was a good time. I didn't watch all of it, but when I was watching the seasons, they were real good. Listen, Greenleaf was it. 
that one episode where Tim Reed was on there when uh, Ray from Sister Sister was on there and she was yelling and that that hair was shifting boy. She was like, "You are from Sister Sister." The daddy from Sister Sister. He was on one of the episodes. Oh, Ray. Ray was on one of the episodes and they was getting into it, boy. Ray Campbell. Wasn't he a limo driver? Yeah. Yeah. He had Ray's limo. Company. Oh, Ray's yeah, limo. <laughs> <laughs> That's so random. He was a limo driver. He owned a limo company. That's so random. Come on, black recording. Mm-hmm. I was mad. You've been recording. Ooh. They made him a Republican. <laughs> How? Because he a business owner? I don't know, but I was mad when I was rewatching oh, the episode. I was like, I forgot about that. What he said? What he was running from? He was running for some, uh, some kind of office. Congress. I said, come on. I'm like, damn. He so, went that far. He ran for Congress. It was something. <laughs> Ray Campbell <laughs> and then they made him a Republican. I was like, God damn, y'all don't know, do that to us. Y'all know damn good well Ray Campbell wasn't was no not a Republican. Now he do give Republican energy, but he don't give like outright Republican energy. He don't give Trumpy. Yeah, but he give uh, tax breaks for the wealthy. <laughs> yeah, he but does. not, but not like bigot Republican. Uh-huh. Uh. But I'm like, y'all know he was that type of dude. Stop that. Yeah, he, I, I, he, he got too good. much sense. Yeah, I was like, he, he got he too, he much. A little bit he, too he, smart he, to fall for that. Yeah. Um, get that little feeling. Sister Friends did uh, take an adventure about yes. two weeks ago and had a great time. It was much needed. We made our way out to Houston for Houston, a Texas, yes. baby. Houston, Texas, baby. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we had so much fun yeah. the food, the comedy. The food. <laughs> the food. We bought them tickets in April. And she talking about the food. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, what were your thoughts, guys, about uh, Tony Baker's show? Man, ten out of ten, March. bro. They Love killed it. B. Lou was a great host. He was a really good host. Keenan killed it. What was the first comedian? Larry. 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 Oh, Larry. oh my Larry. goodness. <laughs> Larry. <laughs> My favorite. Larry Larry's like the cousin, bro. Larry. He was like, bro. y'all see him after the show. Just yeah, he was just standing out there on the phone. My shoes. Tell, he just real chill. Mm-hmm. And I didn't even realize that was him. And I was just like, he just, he just Larry out just here in the cut. But I really appreciated like Tony's comedy and how he just mm-hmm. was so relaxed with the crowd. Yes, because he just has like a really cool demeanor in mm-hmm. general. So his interaction is just so like it like, like he's just telling talking jokes. to him. Yeah, it's like he's just talking. Yeah, but it's just hilarious. And I like it when comedians like say a joke and then they like tie a joke back to a yeah. joke they have already <laughs> said. It just make you like laugh real hard or when they connect with the cities. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I love a I love a good act out when they be acting so <laughs> high, be crying. He had ground turkey. Either. Oh, oh I, I know. Uh, I thought that was so funny. I'm not gonna tell y'all the joke. Just buy the ticket, see the show. Yes. But, oh my God. Go see Tony, man. If you know, you know. When he was just saying ground turkey, and he was just like, <laughs> and that dude, and it was he was pretending like somebody was cutting him off, and it was like ground turkey. <laughs> bro, that is so hilarious. Hilarious. Like, how do you think the, about stuff like, the like creativity, that? bro? Like, he was telling, he wasn't telling the typical jokes, like. Mm-hmm. But this is all relatable content too. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's so relatable. It's not like he's that's doing really it. how men grocery shop, bro. They be I one track. See, I want to see him do acting too. Oh yeah, because he loves movies. Yeah, I feel like. I, I think know. he booked a voice acting role for a cartoon, but I forgot what oh it was. Oh my god! Because I think I was like he would kill it for voice acting. But for I know sure. I definitely want to see Tony on the big screen. I feel like a couple <laughs> years down the road, like he gonna be one of the legends. Like mm-hmm. he, I, I'm so happy we seen him now. Yeah, you know, cause he's already big, but like I do feel like you know down the road, I feel like he's gonna be. I can't wait to be like, man, we saw him. We saw Tony back in down at the, uh, at the uh, at the improv. improv. Yeah, I, I really back like in 2022. Him. And he, just, but he, but you know I, what I really love about him, he really just be, he be hustling for real. Like I was mm-hmm. on his page, he got like what two podcasts. Yeah, yeah, he got, got cardio, issues, verbal cardio. cardio, and he got the gross point bank with like the numbers or like the he does like uh, rankings and stuff for, like movies. And don't albums. he stream too? He does Twitch. He does everything. Now that's a hard the working tour. <laughs> okay, he get to the bag. <laughs> Tony getting to the. He got merch. He got I, everything. He got I respect it. that. So and then he and then he does so many shows a year. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That man is on tour pretty much from mm-hmm. February all the way to December. Bro, I can't wait to watch him just because he deserve it, man. Give, give Tony his flowers, bro. Tony is a fantastic he is comedian. Hilarious. And shout out to him uh, 
you know, commenting on your post. Oh, that that warm, that really wow. me That out. made me really happy when he responded. Like, yes. The recognition. Come on now. You said me? <laughs> out of all the comments, you saw me? I mean, uh-huh. he responded to other people, but I was like, dang. And it wasn't just like, a, oh, thanks. He was like, thank y'all for coming yeah, to the show. Names. Names. I, was like, I names. think that was, he's just yeah. a good person. Yeah. You can tell. I was you like, bro, really little tell. stuff like that don't be mattering probably to the people that say it, but to the people that are your fans or your supporters. I'll be like, and I'm a patron saint, by the way. Join Tony's mm. Patreon. It's a good time. Yeah, you've been out here with your bakery shirt on. Listen, and- man, I'm a huge Tony Baker fan. The movie nights. <laughs> Did you play a game with, was it with Sabrina or with it was Tony? With both of them. They were both on oh, there. Oh, Tony was one too? Yeah, we played uh, uh, Among Us. Yeah. It was lit. It was too lit. Three lit. <laughs> She no more here. Right. She you no more here. I'm staying. I'm really in the bakery. I'm patron saint. Period. <laughs> I got. I got some bakery That's stuff. Fun. That was a. That was a really good experience. Okay. So mm-hmm. I have to go. I want to make that mandatory for me once a year at least. Okay. Oh, a yeah. comedy show. Yeah. Do that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but, she said we'll put it on the agenda. While yeah. we talking about the show, can we talk about the gentleman that was sitting behind me or beside me? He came in on. He came he in sloshed <laughs> and sloshed and slurring his words. My boy was ready to have a good time, and then he ended up looking stupid. You know what? I always, I always just like to embrace people that when they come in like that. Even though, I mean, he went on no like disrespect yeah. enough, but he, he was, was on goofy, ten. Bro. He was goofy. I didn't know which but direction he was gonna go. That's like. why I didn't. He say made me a little me. nervous. I see. That's why I didn't say nothing. I'm like, let me not give him too much. Yeah, cause I don't cause know people that with so much. Confidence, like coming in like mm-hmm. that, I'd be like, once you feed into it, they be trying to go to the <laughs> Not top, to the top, to the top. Because once Cause he came in, like you don't care about what nobody's thinking. They down. make you nervous, <laughs> right? When he came in, he was trying to sit down. He was like, "Sorry, we're gonna touch butts." I was like, "Don't start, bro. <laughs> don't start. Yeah. You already do." I was like, know. "Sit in your seat." For me, I was like, "Okay." Yeah, I'm like, like you can I wanted done. to touch butts, but I was just like, like <laughs> "Yeah, you real bad." I wanted to touch butts. You real welcome, and I was looking at D like. She was like, but you can tell it made me it made me less nervous with him when I saw everybody else at the table was like <laughs> oh yeah, oh okay. Okay. Everybody yeah, from bro. his table the rest was of like, his friends, they were just like, fam, if you don't shut <laughs> Cause he was like talking to the comedians and they like they were afraid, like you said, they were afraid he he may end up seeing something. That's why they was like, let me be something. quiet so we can just keep him. Cause, cause you know how when black people, you know, we just kind of loosely say like nigga, be like, where the nigga at? Blah, blah, blah. And then when he was like, he's over there, I was like, like don't you whoa, say whoa, whoa. It. You <laughs> mean, well, how you know what nigga we talking about? <laughs> how you know? You're, that's not your kid. <laughs> right. Oh, the like, nigga, oh, he that was on. over there around the corner. And he was like, oh, you trying to be a comedian? Yeah. And that's why when B. Lou came out, he was like, these are professional comedians. This is what they do. Right. Y'all mm-hmm. enjoy the show. Let the comedians do their job. Right. This is not just them up here telling jokes. This, but they are, handled him so oh, they did well. so good. you could tell they are professionals yeah they didn't spend the whole like, show <laughs> roasting them they didn't get mad they were just like all right man anyway like bro they, like when keenan keenan shut Kenan it down just real quick and looked at him and he was, was like because like, what he said really did not make sense like, if you take the middle finger you do it like that shut but, up but there was so much it was so much funnier <laughs> that keenan literally stopped and was like and, and just kind of let it all see because yeah. we was all thinking the same yeah. thing. So, and then when he finally said, like, what the hell? Is this? Right. It was, it was funny. Uh, and then they were, and then when they were, like, passing out their own merch at mm-hmm. the end and stuff, and they I were so, they mm-hmm. were so, um, like, efficient, and mm-hmm. they were still, like, you know, because people still want to talk to them. Yeah, they like, were being they, cordial, but they was like, hey, we got to keep it They were keeping it moving. They were being Everybody respectful. else want to buy merch. We can't, everybody can't get up there and tell their story. That Thank was you so much for like, coming to the show. Y'all be safe. Have a good night. I, know. Know. I wanted to fangirl so I better. wanted to. I'm no, like, I was kind of like, like, oh, this, this is weird. <laughs> like, I, I wasn't expecting y'all I'm to like, do bro, this. I'm right. watching y'all on YouTube. Like, you feel like you know them. I'm like, do you know who you are to me? Like, do you know and, who you? And then they're just telling you the <laughs> shit. It's like, <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. But like, bro, like when I tell you, I have never been like so like bubbly. Cause when they said now coming to the stage, Tony Baker, I was like, <gasps> I have never felt those feelings. I was so like, cause 
<laughs> like I have really got like because like we've been watching him. I've been watching Tony for a I minute. I really think because what? How are we all introduced to Tony? Oh, dear. Me too. Mm-hmm. Great yeah. taste. Great taste. Mm-hmm. And like he did like a couple of skits where he was like a janitor. Yes. <laughs> the janitor skits on Great Taste. Yeah. Oh. I mean not on Great Taste, but on All Dev. All Dev. I um yeah because that's the first time I had even did uh, saw All Dev was Great Taste stuff, and yeah. I just remember I used to love when Tony was on there because yes. I thought he was so funny. <laughs> and then you know when, if it was Tony or Teddy Ray, I was like click watching yeah. it. <laughs> it's just so funny, but. Man, that was a good experience. I really had that a good was time. I low key felt like I was doing a little bit a lot. No, nah, you were having a good time. I, was like, I, was like, I had fun and the she laughs said a were natural. Bit a lot. <laughs> but I feel like you was getting. I was, I was really trying to amplify my laughs. No, I was like oh, this is it. No, <laughs> you just you was in the experience. No, nah, that's good. You was good in the moment. Yeah. Hey y'all, this fool was rubbing my back the whole show. <laughs> For every time she, because Tori was sitting like behind me like this, so every time she would laugh, she ah, 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 rubbing my back. The whole That's because show. I knew I was cackling in her ear, so I was like, Ooh. <laughs> that was her problem. Really, <laughs> just trying to console her with these with these cackles in her. Ear. That's what made me laugh even harder. Because I'm like, why is she rubbing why my back? Why is she rubbing my back? <laughs> Oh man, I mean, that's right. <laughs> right. Oh, hey, man. our server was funny too, bro. Yeah, he was. Oh, he was a little, yeah, little John for because it was during Halloween, mm-hmm. Halloween weekend. So he was little John. It was hilarious. He was nice. You could yeah. tell. I'm he glad really, I got those wings. Yeah, mm-hmm. you could tell oh, he enjoyed his job. <laughs> like he have a good time just coming yeah. to work. The drinks were good too. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, they mm-hmm. did a good job. Was your Philly tickler tickler? My little tickler, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the only thing I, I was like, that name was so funny. Asking Lil John to take our picture. Yeah. Yes. Dang. I wish I had just excuse me. Hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 that's <laughs> true. Right. That was a good thing. experience, yeah. though. Good time. Thank you for a good show, Tony, B. Yeah, Lou, Keenan, Larry. Thank y'all so much for a great show. Man, that Crawford's joke. Bruh, but I, I had you I, I, that was probably the loudest motherfucker in it. <laughs> <laughs> nah, that five o'clock joke. Oh, yes. When I tell you, I oh, scream. Oh the way God. he turned His around, his facial he was like, expressions. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No, I was tripping out as soon as we had made it back home from Houston. I automatically thought of Tony's joke of missing a damn exit. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I think he reposted that one on his like, Instagram. Uh-huh. He was like, everything in Texas is too far. He was like, everything got an exit. Everything is right off the highway. You miss your exit. God. And he was like, you can't move around. You got to <laughs> like, roll out the car. <laughs> Cause mm-hmm. how many times did I miss my ex? Girl, I can't it tell you how many times going to Dallas or something I done missed. Oh, you gotta get. Driving in Texas is just its own subject in itself, darling. But I appreciate it. different. I, I like the plains and I like seeing the trees. Oh yeah, it's a it's a nice <laughs> calm drive. Like once you get like on that straightaway, it's nice and calm. It's nice. Yeah. I couldn't imagine just seeing concrete buildings everywhere. Like, oh, I like the gosh. trees and the grass well, and stuff. The lack of it keeps you calm. People probably watching it like, oh. <laughs> I need some type of like country bumpkin. Right? <laughs> you like looking at trees and grass. <laughs> yeah, it's better than looking at an office building. <laughs> That's true. Oh, it's we are. They don't want to be one with nature. Right. That don't keep y'all calm when y'all just drive. That's hilarious. <laughs> just looking at the scenery and things. No, and I'm, I'm thankful that the weather was decent. Mm, mm-hmm. man, the weather was, was nice. One too hot, yeah. one too cold. I'm glad it didn't cool. rain. How do you like that? Um, what's that spot we went to after that? The show? Lyrics. Lyrics. Market? Lyrics. I thought it looked so beautiful. Oh, yeah. Nice. It was really nice, nice set up. I'm pretty sure it's popping, you know, at the heavy hours. Uh, oh, yeah. I was like, I know it is. coming here during lunch, bro. You ain't getting no mm-hmm. lunch. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't getting really nice work set on time. Up. It's very pretty. You know, when I was making comment about that waffle, I didn't realize that the woman was through there. <laughs> what you say? I what you say? say? And I was just like, man, this waffle wasn't what I thought. And I was like, she just took my order. <laughs> <laughs> Why did I say that right here in front of her? I should have waited until we got in the car. I think this waffle wasn't what I thought. <laughs> That was okay. It was on your heart. <laughs> yeah, that waffle was good. I like mine. That was real good. No, the was flavor called? was good. Mm. The something, the special. I don't know, child. Mm. It had, the, had Nutella. It had the cookie butter, the Nutella, the cookie butter. That was so good. Yes. Yeah. It was like cake. Which one did you get? 
I got the uh, Dulce de Leche with the cinnamon on top. It was busted. Mm. Churro? Mm hmm. The churro, that's what it was. Churro. Mm. Listen, check out the Lyric Market, and they have some black owned business in there. Yeah. We didn't stop by, but because we just get dessert. <laughs> we fake. <laughs> right. That's just so, yeah. fake. It was some Noya folks. We had, we had some beer tacos. Ooh. 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 Yes, we Ooh. It was good. Ooh. That Elote was hitting that taco. Mm-hmm. We went to the drag show. Yes. Yeah, not I think that's a shout element. out to Tamar Giselle. Yeah, did that, that sister. sister? Yes, I mean, all, all of them, all of everybody did, did well. it. Contour Kitty, Tamar Giselle, <laughs> you uh, know, that's her friend. Love, uh, Blake, love, Desi, love Blake, or Blake, love Desi, one of them. I'm so sorry, but killed it. They were killed them. Oh, they yeah, the fact that she remembered their name. She knows the memory, though. Listen. Listen. She can really, remember it's, specifics it's, in movies. It's really not. I have trash memory. I just like to remember things that I enjoy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile. That was good. <laughs> but, but yeah. Not to got on show. stage. And you got me a free <laughs> shot. <laughs> Got a free shot. Say, that was fun. That was. I think that was my I'm highlight when you got that. on stage. Yeah, I'm glad you went out there. You need to. Cause the uh, the person that was main of the lights, he was like, "Ain't nobody up here." So he was like, "He was like, you tell he was trying to get more people." Uh, yeah, but he was like, "Girls, free liquor. You better go." I was like, he said promotion, anything, anything, <laughs> something, <laughs> breathing. <laughs> he was trying to get somebody. But that was fun to watch. It was a good oh, time, man. And then the people that was up there, they're just like, oh, everybody was good energy. Oh yeah, nobody was. It was a sour. perfect weekend too, because you saw all types of people. You yeah. know, as far as like people, up, you saw the queen, suit and tie yeah, folks. Weekend. You saw the niggas. <laughs> <laughs> But Tamar did the best, a hundred percent. She put on a hundred percent. Fantastic show, shit like. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And the playlist. It, I really liked the energy. host too. I thought he was hilarious. Oh my yeah. god, perfect. perfect. Desi, Desi was so great because like they're almost like comedians, but mixed with I think dancers, but yeah. mixed with actors. Like mm-hmm. like her personality, I think, is just perfect for mm-hmm. hosting yes. she, she, she like, throws like, like she can host anything. and she's quick because yes. you're, you're you know interacting with people that you don't know what the heck they're gonna say <laughs> yeah. but you're quick with so a I'm joke like, and everybody can't that's do good that. that's right. good that's solid like yeah, just go. What was that Hamburger Mary? Mm-hmm. Yes, Mary. Y'all mm-hmm. check out mm-hmm. Hamburger Mary's. If y'all like drag shows, if y'all and the food was good too. Ooh, the food was good. Mm-hmm. Like that burger. they do the good drink <laughs> specials. Like oh yes, we had mimosas. Ah, oh, mimosas good. Yes. And yes. then they give you like different juices. They had like a guava. Tropical yeah, they had. Juice. They it had was like ramen. What three or four different mm-hmm. juices? It was like three different juices. Mm-hmm. So yeah. you can just like hop around and do your thing. Yes, ma'am. Very yes, ma'am. Good. It was a good, good time. Per. They got an ATM. Get your dollars. Yes. Tip, yes. tip the bros. I know you was ready. ATM. Oh yeah, that's one thing I didn't. I wasn't expecting just the like the tips and stuff. Oh yeah. So I'm glad. I'm I'm glad I know that now. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But I was happy. But they did so so great. The costumes, the makeup, the everything so great. The music, they worked everything. real hard, and too. they did good with the decoration. You can tell they weren't playing with them decoration. They said, "Oh, it's Halloween." You can have yeah. the lights, it made the me mannequins, the, mm. the screens, everything. They did that. They did a really good job. They really did. Very hospitable. Very nice. And we were, we felt like we was in the VIP because we were sitting up on the balcony. Oh yeah, mm-hmm. really with nobody up top. It right, and yeah. they made it, they made it a point to like have everybody they still took came up around to see the us. Mm-hmm. I love that. They did a good we job. We had a good time. Yeah, they did a good job. We had a real good time. Yeah. And that's and that's on our Houston trip. Period. And. <laughs> the only thing I did not like was being that high up we was out on like the 16th floor and these folks oh. go let's look over the balcony no <laughs> no <laughs> yes. Yes. Tori went out there in the dark and I'm like y'all she finna fall up I, oh my God. the wind finna you, blow you always never somebody gonna fall though <laughs> She'd be like, Jay, don't stand on that you gonna fall I'm like, God, hey. <laughs> I'm 72 Uh, rest in peace to take off girl. Absolutely. Uh, that was hard to hear so yeah. young, talented real chill in the cut, he wasn't bothering nobody he wasn't doing the most that man was rapping 
and went back to doing whatever he was doing. He was never in no mess. Rest in peace to another young black man taken, gone too soon. Yeah, Very another much so. rapper. Yeah, another rapper. Like this is wild, y'all. This is freaking wild. I didn't even believe it when I saw it. I was at work. Yeah. Uh, no, I was on that, that, I that really, that really threw me. Yeah, I was. Uh, what was I? I was just uh, at work and they got the little little suggestion box of the local news and mm-hmm. whatnot. I said, "Take her." I mean, what the heck? Yeah. <laughs> Trying to look and see what happened. But yeah, that know, made me mad just, for real. It's disturbing. I'm gonna tell y'all this and leave it at that. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately, it's a convenience and it's a reoccurring thing within the hip hop community. I don't know what it is about hip hop or just black culture in general where we are um, uh, drawn to or obsessed with death. Mm -hmm. And uh, next to sex, death sells. So I feel it, like because we just see it so much. It's just disturbing how, the timing of it all. Because mm-hmm. he and, and um, Quavo just dropped a project, mm-hmm. just dropped an album. You. So, you know, of course the views are going to go up, the yeah. sales are going to go up. And it's, it's just, just a, it's unfortunate a weird that you feeling. can't. Um, you know, here to reap what he sold. Exactly. Yeah, because he got, got so many followers, like on his Instagram, like after That's wild to yeah, me, bro. It's like, and then he had like a little clip that was like, um, you know, he he wants to get his flowers, like why he still give them to me while I'm still here, mm-hmm. you know. Mm-hmm. But he was 28. Like he didn't even get to, you know, have a family. You At know, if, if that's what he wanted, right. mm-hmm. you know, he had like, like, a lot bro. of experiences and stuff, but. And say what you want about the Migos music, but like they could have won a Grammy. They could have like we don't know. Like and we were supposed to see them in like a reunion. Right. Tour. That's what I was. That's, that's what, what was uh, somebody was saying. Like we were supposed to see them come back in like twenty forty and be like, yo, the Migos hitting the stage on like some type of awards. And it was just supposed to be like the three of them up there, old as hell, looking old as stuff. Like, <laughs> like, uh, like, like them people be like doing, Rick- <laughs> right? <laughs> and then we all up in the in the living room going crazy, and the kids looking at us like, "Who is this?" I'm like, "Y'all don't know, bro." The yeah. Migos had it on lock. Mm, I ha- ooh, that made me mad. Super. That, that's all I had. And to people say being so much. disrespectful and posting, you know. Uh, stuff from that Y'all night. stop that. Stop it. <clears throat> that is so disrespectful to, disrespectful to the person that is dead, to their family, to their friend. It's just twisted and life to the people world. that just don't want to see that. Like, that's somebody's life gone and you up here. And I respect a lot of the, the, the blog sites that did not post that. Because mm-hmm. your dog would have got views and all that yeah. stuff. But I'm glad, you know, that uh, some of them, you know, chose not to post it out of respect for them. And, and, and fuck E! News for... <laughs> Putting that picture of Quavo talking about something. If you don't some care, if off, you don't care about our culture, then leave us stop. alone. You literally did not have to post nothing. Every every black man ain't the same person. Every black person ain't interchangeable, bro. Okay. They did they do that with Aretha. <clears throat> Oh no, one one news. They do that uh, with uh, all whole bunch They of put news, Gladys man. on there talking about rest in peace, Aretha. Oh my god. <laughs> My thing no. is like, and I hope, and I hope that's not intentional in order to get views. Uh, so people can get mad, so they can get people to just engage, right. like a catfish or a clickbait. Like, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna post know, the wrong thing on purpose so you can get mad. I, and say I really something. hope that's not what it Either was way, because all you ha- all you had to literally do was Google. look up take off. All you had to do was Google Migos members. He's click. very Googleable. <laughs> like Come literally, on. literally, your job can all be done through Google. So and you, you could have did that on there. I'm like, you didn't even try, bro. You was like one of these niggas, whoever. Man, that 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 pissed me off for real. Have some more respect for that. If you don't care about, you know, if you don't care, culture, then shut so, up. Just don't, just don't try to profit off of us. You don't Stop. never report on them anyway. Right? I was like, you didn't say nothing when they was hitting American Music Awards and all these other red right. carpets. Right? You weren't like giving but, them the flowers. But, then, but when, when he was they murdered, died. you're oh, like, oh, yeah. let me post another rapper shot. Yeah, <laughs> get out of here, bro. Get yeah. out of here. Never knew. Didn't know that. Surprised they got the name right. Mm. Can't believe y'all did that. Ooh, you know that pissed me off so I don't bad. expect too much from the people that had the Kardashians on there for 10 years. So, whatever. Mm-hmm. Oh, that is them. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, whatever. forget y'all. Anyway. Um, again, rest in peace. We'll move on from that. I just I just want to share. That, yeah. that was disturbing. This <clears throat> rest well. You Job well done, sir. You brought us a lot of entertainment, a lot of, a lot of bars, a lot of fun. Mm. <laughs> Bang. Bang.